All right, folks, what's cracking? Um, wanted to show y'all again uh, some of the little things of my little mini homestead. <laughs> my, my wife and I, uh, well, I mostly joke that we got a little mini homestead here. And somehow I done got found a woman that's actually into uh, all this. And I know, you know, a lot of y'all are, but a lot of women aren't. So uh, I'm happy about that, man, because <laughs> guess that means I get to keep her. But anyway, uh, so um, I wanted to show actually, I wanted to show actually um, our little our little irrigation system. So I got this this thing on here, and this actually is supposed to um, automatically. Uh, you, you can turn your water on automatically. You can schedule it, and it'll come on. You know, at a certain time of day and just be on and then go off you know you know it comes on for for two minutes five minutes ten minutes fifty minutes thirty sixty you know at different times of day now uh... what you gotta do is you gotta turn on the water and leave it on and this little lock here is supposed to hold that pressure back up in inside here just like this would hold the pressure but the thing is this this just i had some trouble with this when i moved it to the new location so i'm not doing it like that now because i don't want it to be dripping and then it's, you know, you can drip a whole lot of water in a short period of time and cause yourself a whole lot of, you know, uh, money spent. Anyway, um, we just keep it on now. So you didn't even have to, you don't even necessarily have to get one of those. But if you can get one and figure it out, that, that really, really helps. Because everything inside of the gardening and growing food that you can do to make it easier is a good thing. I mean, you might feel like oh I like the hard work you know I got some friends they was getting into it they're, oh I like the hard work and spending time outside that's that's real you know and it's righteous and you love it but the thing is at a certain point you just won't have time for it. We, live, we modern people so we just don't be having time to really you know be spending outside like that so this is a PVC line you know PVC don't cost nothing um, and, it, and the line runs down Right here, let me see if you can see it. Where we at? The line runs down, down under, you know, along the house, underneath the ground, comes up right here in the garden, and then we have the little soaker, the micro soaker hoses that run through the garden, and so that's how we uh, water our little uh, beat up, <laughs> suffering garden. It, um, it, it, it took it took a you know all this rain we've been having really really been beating the garden to death I would have thought it would be good but it was just too much so y'all already seen you know the little garden or whatever so habanero is doing pretty good bell pepper is doing pretty good some of these other ones they they all right the ginger look like it need a little water right now um you know we've been eating the basil it's been delicious the eggplant, however, has been suffering because of the ants, and, and really I haven't even been able to get them to really take up the borax and the sugar thing like I wanted to, so they still in there, you know, and uh, so I don't really, you know, we're going to keep trying to figure it out. Uh, somebody said, go ahead and use the regular, the regular chemicals on them. Um, I don't, I don't, I don't know. It seemed like the plants would take up, you know, whatever. It's they in a box, you know. It seemed like they would take up whatever that you put in there. You know, it's not like a you find an ant hill and put some am, amdro on it, you know. But um, I don't know, you know. We we gonna figure it out, I guess. Uh, yeah. So I love the little the little watering system. I think it's excellent. You know, you can't hardly see it. It just comes on, sprinkles the garden. You leave it on. Um, it don't spray all over the place, so you're not wasting water. Um, you know, it's just it's just soaker hose go right in, water it, and uh, really no muss, no fuss, and you ain't got to stand outside watering it, even if you think it's fun. You know, at first, um, we got a little improvised box garden here. You know. Um, Cause we had a whole bunch of volunteer tomatoes come up, so we just we just threw up a whole imp improvised little tub garden. Um, I, somebody said it, it, it. 
they had a ghetto garden and I was looking, I was like, damn, y'all got the same garden, you got the same garden I got. In fact, yours look better than mine. So I, <laughs> I don't know, I don't know if there's a ghetto garden. We live in the country, so it might be some a country garden, y'all don't know, but uh, about the same type of thing here. So, you know, uh, one love, I'll let y'all. Peace.